Okay. So, did you and Catherine really break up? Yes. Oh, I see. Enough about that. Back to yesterday. Try and remember. Uh, I told you already. Seriously? Yeah, you're talking about last night, aren't you? I remember everything. You came here alone. You left alone. And the entire time you were here, you drank alone. Right, Toby? That's exactly how I remember it. Maybe you're just spacing out from lack of sleep. After all, you were pretty messed up last night. Uh, yeah, you were totally fucked up, dude. So, so, so what? I, I was just dreaming the entire time I was here? I'm sick of these goddamn dreams every goddamn night. Wait, th then when did that dream start? This is so fucked up! Hey, man, keep it down. I'm only in this mess because I cheated with her. Come on, someone tell me, where the hell is she? Dude, I don't know. <sighs> My head hurts. Hey, are you all right? Yeah, like that. You were by yourself just like that. Maybe you were dreaming. You're really messed up. I'm not messed up. I'm just saying that it's impossible for her not to exist. Anyway, pills, alcohol, nothing works for that. Yeah, I keep seeing it. Whoa, you guys are still having it? Although now that you mention it, Erica looked like she was having a nightmare too. <laughs> you noticed? I don't remember anything though. Are you too, Erica? I thought only men had that dream. So maybe gender doesn't matter, huh? Uh, well, uh, I'm not so sure. <sighs> It's because you guys won't shut up about nightmares. The same thing with the other customers, too. Is it a weird chain reaction? Hey, dreams we've been having. Don't you feel like we're all seeing the same dream? Really? I can't remember much, but you know, it felt like I was trying to get the hell away from something. Uh, like that? Just climbing up and up. Yeah, mine was like that, too. Or more like struggling without getting anywhere. So what, we're being shown the same dream? <laughs> Dumbass. Dreams are just a reflection of daily stress. <laughs> stress? <laughs> From what? Dude, there's plenty of stress in everyday life. Oh, yeah, but... Does that mean I'm gonna have these nightmares too, eventually? Oh, man, I hope not. It's all because this jackass started talking about it. Since I've been hanging out with him so much, he's transferred some of his stress onto me. So, Vincent, how are you gonna make it up to us, huh? Mm. Out like a light. Oh, he's messed up again. <sighs> I'm going home. My head hurts. I understand being shocked, but does it really screw someone up this bad? <sighs> we have an early shift tomorrow, too. Oh, yeah, you're right. We should get going. Hey, Vincent. We're gonna take off now. You sure you're okay by yourself? Uh, I'm not crazy. The jury's still out. He's not gonna tell us he met that girl again later on, is he? Idiot. I wouldn't do that. But I did see her last night. Yeah, yeah. We've heard that from you all night long, remember? Well, thanks for the fucking help. I'm just gonna drink some more. I'll keep an eye on him, so you guys can go on home. I'm sorry, Erica. Take care of him, will you? I'll be fine. I just want to figure out what is going on. Hey, you all right? Mind if I sit here? Uh, hi, excuse me. Mind if I sit here? What? Uh, I was just thinking about it. It's only been a week since... Since when? Since I met that girl here. Can life really change this much just like that? Mm, it happens. But maybe it's the dreams. If you don't get enough sleep, your brain won't function right, and you start seeing things differently. So you're saying that you think she's an illusion too, right? No, I'm not saying that. Yes, you are. So, to be honest, I, I don't even know what's going on myself. Fuck. A lot happened. You're probably just a bit confused. Plus, you have been drinking a lot lately. Hey, can I get an order? Uh, sure thing. Maybe I am going crazy. Fuck. Okay. That night.
night, it was like this. I had a bad dream the night before, so I was here drinking, trying to forget. They all left early. I stayed here, then... Then she walked in. <sighs> Wait a second. That night, when she walked in the bar, there was something... Wow, well, there's a lot of people here. But this isn't really my crowd. to someone else besides me. Oh, yes. May I help you? What, what are you going on about? No, 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 no. Don't play coy with me. I'm talking about Catherine. You saw her, didn't you? I saw her? Um, excuse me, Don't but... Don't fuck with me, old man! I am serious! Hey! Hey, Vincent! Everyone else said that they didn't see her. Then don't you think it's crazy that only you did? You're the one that's crazy. Me? See her? Because of her, I'm starting to lose it. I already know that you're the key. Damn it! Why didn't I realize it sooner? Come on! Cut it out! <laughs> You saw her! I know you saw her! Speak up! Stop moaning and answer me, goddammit! Vincent! Fuck! <coughs> Just... say something. Please, man. Please. Tell me that you saw her! Well, very well. <clears throat> if you must persist. Yes, I did indeed see her. Huh? She was blonde, wearing a provocative white dress, like lingerie. Yeah, 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 that's the girl. And you saw her with me yesterday, right? Yes, of course. It's your preference, isn't it? <laughs> Girls like her. So then, you admit it. All right. See? He did see her. <sighs> Jesus. Really? You are just full of surprises. Not only did you survive this long, but to think you figured me out. Huh? I must commend you for your perception. Uh, well, I didn't really perceive anything. And sorry about the choking. A lot happened, so I was a bit freaked out. <laughs> Tell me you didn't see her. There is no way she does not exist. <laughs> well, normally that is the case. Normal people can't see her after all. <laughs> oh, uh, <laughs> Wait, what? That's only natural. After all, she isn't from this realm. Boss? It was rather unnatural, wasn't it? <laughs> A girl like her in a town like this? <laughs> Either way. You don't need to worry. <laughs> I have given up on showing you nightmares. Showing me nightmares? It was quite a sight watching you run like the wind. Uh, what are you talking about? Huh? She was here, right? Her. Catherine. Huh? Uh, wait, you didn't rush me because... I just... I just wanted proof that she really existed. I knew that you saw her. You did, right? Ah. Uh, I see. Ah. Uh, hey. <clears throat> the usual, sir. Rum and cola, was it? Hey, boss. Can I ask you something? Uh, what would that be? You see, I thought that nightmares were something that you see on your own. So could it be... that... That... That someone else can show you one? Well, I, I, I wonder... Come on. Uh, well, I, I wonder... I wonder my ass. Pretty sure I just heard you say you're somehow involved in this. Uh, did I? You heard him, right? Huh? Uh, yeah, he did. So what was that all about? Huh? Uh, uh, what did I say? You were surprised I survived? What does that mean? I didn't say that. You said it. I didn't say it. Stop fucking with me! I know that you're hiding something! Tell me! I don't know. Why do I have to go through all this shit? 
Well, it's not just you. Excuse me, I was not expecting this turn of events. Fuck you! Every day is unexpected for me! And what is with these fucking shades? You are indoors! Stop. You're dealing with a desperate man now. Thanks to you and your bullshit, Catherine and I are through. Explain yourself, you fucking monster. <sighs> Allow me to introduce myself. I, Thomas Mutton, and... Okay, okay. Uh, to sum it up, when there are people like you who spend a long amount of time with a partner without commitment, it impedes the population model. The rate of population growth is less than optimal. What the hell are you talking about? So, I have these hesitant gentlemen climb that. Wait, you're talking about the nightmare? Oh, you're the one behind that? Who, who the hell are you? I have been given many names by humans since ancient times. Wasting a woman's time of greatest fertility is a hindrance to the future of the species. So we separate these non-fruitful couples and redistribute the women to men who can follow the natural order, you see? Okay, so what? You're just killing men who have a partner that they don't want to marry? Is that it? Well, to put it bluntly... You think I'm gonna accept your bullshit story? Please do not worry. You won't see that young girl ever again. Huh? She is a succubus. She appears at will and seduces men under the curse by appearing as their ideal woman. If you're going to sever ties with a longtime partner, what better way than with a messy affair, right? Oh, man. <sighs> Do you understand everything now? <laughs> yeah, I get it. I get everything. So, in the end, what am I guilty of? Uh... If the girl doesn't exist, then it's not cheating. <sighs> if it feels like cheating, then it's cheating, right? You think... You think you can just get away with this? Uh, well, it isn't like I just started this job yesterday. After all, the reason you were born was because we weeded out the man who was misleading your mother. <laughs> I do believe that was the case. You better stop fucking with me. If you don't wish to believe, that's fine. However, it is a necessary evil. <sighs> Having a broken heart may be painful, but you have also earned your freedom. Plus, you have a fierce will to survive. You should be able to grasp happiness again soon enough. To me, she... she was already family. I only realized that after I was dumped. How pathetic is that? I really can't help you there. This entire situation is your fault, right? So what are you gonna do about it, huh? What? You're the one who cheated. How is that my fault? Well, it sure as shit isn't mine. You're the cause of it all. Plus, I was ready to get married. You got your wish. Uh, but that was only due to your cheating on her, right? Besides, it's too late to make up with her now. You don't get to decide that. If you really intend to push me, tonight I will have to show you what I can really do. If that happens, then tonight will certainly be your last. Are you prepared to die? Prepared to die, huh? Ooh. I tell you, what if you die here before I do? Vincent! Hey, wait a second. <laughs> Yo, you still alive? Yeah, we came back since we're worried about you. Let's drink some more, man. Wouldn't be able to sleep anyway. I didn't have any problem sleeping. Uh, hey. 
something happen? Uh, guys! Boss and Vincent are... It's okay, don't say anything. Uh, but... What's wrong? Uh, sorry, I, uh, I haven't finished my chat with him yet. You guys start the party without me. Whatever you say. Just don't go aggro, you drunk. Ah, don't worry, we're just... Just playing some games here. <laughs> right? Yes, that's right. <laughs> There's no point screwing around with you. I'll let you off. For now. But in return, about what you were saying, if I am still alive tomorrow, you're gonna grant me my wish. Wait, Vincent. What are you saying? I'm telling you, it's impossible. Then you should have no problem making that promise. If you really can control the nightmares, then make this one the last. It will be the last, whether you win or lose. Not just for me, everyone else. It ends tonight. And not only that, you're going to arrange to have Catherine meet me here. That's impossible. Well, I can't do it. I can't call her, and it's not like I can just text her. <sighs> Very well. If you agree, then I honor your conditions. Really? Great. And remember, you better keep your promise. Got it? Oh, hey, Vincent. Are you sure about this? One week of this bullshit is more than enough. And sorry to make you worry back there, but I gotta end this. Not so much with this jackass, but with myself. What's with him? Acting all badass. So was the boss. You said... <sighs> Where? Boss? Genau. So. Gut schauen. Ich glaube, die Mail ist das nur für Midnight Venus oder Emma. Ja. Hier haben wir die Glückwunschnachricht. Okay, ja. Den können wir jetzt alles noch sprechen. Also im normalen Fall, wenn man jetzt nicht aufs böse Ende hinaus will, sei ich mal so, sind hier definitiv mehr Leute. Jetzt sind nur Vincent, äh, Orlando, Johnny und Toby da, sowie äh, Lindsay Martha und auch Erika. Aber im Normalfall, wenn man jetzt wirklich alle retten möchte oder sehr viele halt nicht in den Tod treibt, so wie es wir getan haben, wären sehr viel mehr Leute hier, so wie Justin immer da sitzt oder Archie und Todd immer an der Bar gesessen sind, so wie er auch morgen hier vorne gesessen hat. Uh, sprechen wir doch mal letztes Mal mit Lindsay und Martha. Und wir haben sogar noch eine Mail bekommen. Mr. Vincent Brooke, 
Einige unserer neuen Handymodelle hatten, hatten Probleme, auf unsere Online-Medienspeicherdienste zuzugreifen. Bitte entschuldigen Sie die Unannehmlichkeiten. Das Problem wird behoben, indem wir uns nützliche online gespeicherte Daten per SMS senden. Ich glaube, Daniel und N sind immer da, egal ob man jetzt gut oder böse macht. Da mal, glaube ich, Daniel nicht in den Tod treiben kann. Tja, was ich auch schon sagen kann, ist, dass wir das auch noch beeinflussen werden. Say so, man. But if you do something to get us on the news, and we're all gonna have to go on the. Well, that sounds good. It'll be like when we were kids. Out. So we're adults now, huh? Hey, what are you talking about, guys? Maybe when you're older, kid. Hey, that's mean. Stimmt ja. Tobi ist ja ein bisschen jünger als die anderen. Tonight, I'll escape it. 
gesagt, im Normalfall wären eben die meisten Tische bzw. auch hier würden ein paar Leute rumstehen. Ähm, zum Beispiel auch den ein äh, verdammt den den äh, den das Ölgeschäft gehört, der würde auch da sitzen, würde man auch zum ersten Mal sehen. Ich glaube Steve wäre. Ich glaube Steve wäre nicht da. Einfach da Steve die einzige Person ist, die man nicht retten kann. So viel ich es noch weiß. Hey, how much of what you were talking about tonight is true? <lacht> you really never true or not. I don't think I can look. This is the end. He needs to take responsibility. Look, just don't be stupid about it. <lacht> I'll be fine. Ja, vergeht die Zeit wieder mal. Excuse me. Did you hear? I figured out who the witch is. Really? It was me. <laughs> you know all that shit that went on when we were young? Seems it got mixed in with the... Well, you did disappear that one time. And to think I just... Was there anyone who believed it? Well, I never believed in the first... Listening to you never leads to anything. What? Anyway, about what you and Boss were talking about? Dumbass. It's all a lie. Don't worry about it. Tomorrow we can... Okay. Come back here tomorrow, okay? I'm sure Rin's rooting for... Today's lead story is the mysterious weakening deaths. James Thompson, age 33, was found dead today. Was he in the nightmare too? Were we climbing together? And George Baker, age 30. Once again, the names of the deceased. Tja. Schau, ich glaube, sonst hat die Kanone was zu sagen. Ja. Äh, ich sehe auch gerade, dass ich den Part wahrscheinlich in drei Teile schneiden werde. Ah, wir könnten ja nochmal kurz ein bisschen. Äh, schauen, ob wir den Boss der Stage sehen werden. Haben wir auch schon ewig lang nicht mehr gemacht. Na, ja, sieht nicht danach aus. Aber ist ja auch egal. Auf jeden Fall werde ich den Part dann an dieser Stelle beenden. Oder bis gesagt, die drei Parts. Äh, Lasst wie immer eine Bewertung da. Ich würde mich darüber freuen. Wir sehen uns im nächsten Part. Oder in den nächsten Parts. Mal schauen, wie viele es werden. Ich, ja, ich kann nur auf jeden Fall an dieser Stelle halt noch Tschüss sagen.